Hello everyone, it is Drawings by Alexander, and welcome back to today's video. It's gonna be a little bit of a sadder video, but you know, it is what it is. Um, I look pretty, pretty enthusiastic in the beginning, but I'm not. This video is me explaining why I might be taking a leave from YouTube or quitting YouTube. Um, this is a sketchbook tour of a sketchbook I did. Well, th this year, because it's like 2018, but I did it like last school year. But anyway, this is just me explaining why I'm quitting YouTube. So yeah, um, basically I'm quitting YouTube because I'm not seeing the results I want to see in my channel and it's not really growing the way I want to and I feel like all my subscribers I know and that very little people I don't know watch my videos and that my channel isn't really going anywhere as of, re as of recently. I know maybe I should just wait it out and keep on posting videos, but for now I think I'm gonna take a leave and I already have some videos that are pre-recorded that I'm gonna post for like the next two Sundays or something. And I think by then I'll be ready to come back to YouTube and try again and maybe start posting consistently or whatever. So that's gonna be a big goal for me. And, you know, I've just been really struggling with not seeing the results, as I said before. So make sure to share with everyone you know, tell people about it, all that stuff. Because I really want to start seeing results in my channel and start seeing growth and stuff like that. And this isn't just for, like, me to, like, grab tension or whatever. Like, it's just something, like, I've been thinking about doing for a while now. So, Yeah. Oh, I'm probably gonna get demonetized because I did some anatomy practice and there's some nudity, but it's okay. Here's me zooming in on my jelly roll pen and it has a sparkle in it. And it actually came out like pretty well on camera. I thought you wouldn't be able to see it, but you can. It's very nice. Um, yeah, anyways, to, let's, I'm gonna put a light in the moon now after all that sad stuff. I was going to talk about the drawings. Oh, this drawing, I was in a really bad mood that day, and so, like, this drawing is supposed to represent my mood, which is why I, like, use, like, purple and cooler tones to shade. It's also supposed to be, like, a Disney villain or something. I don't know. It's weird. <laughs> then I have a blank page, which I never did anything with. This piece I didn't really like because I didn't get the emotion in the character that I wanted to. And it's supposed to be Cher from it's supposed to be Cher from Clueless. And like she's trying to do magic, but it went, it's going really wrong. Cause she's clueless. No, okay. <laughs> no one understands what I, <laughs> the idea behind that piece, but it is what it is. This one is a favorite of a lot of people. I really like how he did the blonde hair. The, the shoulders of the sleeves and the dress um, are supposed to be see-through. I think I did like a pretty good job showing that they're see-through. I don't know, you guys can be the judge of that. The cat looks really derpy though, and I thought that was really funny. And my twin always points it out to me that, oh, the cat looks super derpy. The face did not come out so good though. <laughs> this is like an angel or something holding flowers I don't know what I was thinking I was just doing me yeah and then these are thumbnail sketches for a contest I did well spoiler I didn't win the competition I came in second place but I think I should have won but I see like so many mistakes in this drawing like on the like the left hand isn't even connected into the sleeve like outside there's like no arm connected to it it's really weird but and then in the background i did aurora aurora borealis Ugh. this one is really bad i did it while i was on vacation so i just skipped it really fast and then this one i tried out the um arteza fine liners and i really like them but you can't use them with watercolor which is my only problem 
I think that their colors are like a little bit too bright for me and I like ruined a lot of pieces using their fine liners because like at, in the end I didn't like like the outcome of the outlines because they're way too bright and this is another contest right now and update I didn't win and I think I should have won that one too but you know it is what it is that is just like more like sketch it like sketches and not finished things and I feel like the main thing in the sketchbook is that I learned how to do anatomy much better and I learned like a lot of new tips and like proportions and stuff like that that I didn't know before so I think I really grew as an artist in the sketchbook because in some sketchbooks like I don't notice that much growth but in this one I did and then this one went this piece I loved so much and the only problem is that um, in the crotch area um, it looks like she has a bulge and it's really not supposed to look like that. Bye, thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video.